Oh, so it's the rivet nut drill adapter. Oh, all the sizes, blah, blah, blah. When you open it up, you got these little cases to hold a specific. You got some M10s and some big boys that are out by themselves. And then the small ones. So you got the metric on this side. You got the standard on that side. You got your tool itself. You got a little tool to change out the heads. So if you see right here, you got your M3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 8, 10. Then you got your quarter, 20, 24, 20, and 32. So, you got all your kind of standard sizes. You couldn't do everything, but you could probably adapt stuff. Just change out screws to make it work. And you got a couple of little, you know, inserts for each one. So, I, I, the one that's on here when you open the box is the, the 832. And uh, I just went ahead and pulled one out of that bag right there to kind of display what's going on with it. So, you would drill a hole in your item stuff this down in the hole right and once you stuff this down well you could probably like not stuff it down the hole but anyway you, you'd screw it onto here to wherever you are and stuff it in the hole and then run your drill and go ahead and tighten it i, I don't want to waste an insert on this video so anyway you get the, the skinny of it out show you what happens once you got it on there it's gonna start drilling and retract that thing until the metal in the insert smashes down which is it's an awesome thing I, I love these so this is a very awesome tool smaller than <laughs> the alternatives really because you hook it to your regular impact that you already have that you're working with anyway and small kit uh, changing these out I would show it but it's not really necessary I mean, you unscrew this piece which is just like a locking ring once you do that, then you unscrew the whole thing. Once you unscrew the whole thing, you know, you got the uh, centerpiece and then the outer. So pretty simple. A, a good setup. I like it. Thanks.